Guys, I just got to give a shout out to Jackery and having a power station. Um, I love this. Look at this thing. I've got my Steam Deck charging, got my power bank charging, have my GoPro charging, have my fan charging, and it's going to recharge via my car. So this thing has saved me so much money already. I know they start out as a big investment, but the free electricity is awesome. I'm not sponsored, dude. Just thought I would say how awesome these are and how much I love this thing. Alrighty guys, it's a couple days till Halloween, so I gotta go do a little crazy stealth camping today. I'm going to be spending the night next to a graveyard, a cemetery, and my mom actually asked me to play the Ouija board and see if I can talk to any spirits. Um, I'm going to try to do that. I also brought another little surprise. And um, yeah, so we will see what happens. <laughs> I don't know, I'm pretty scared, man. I, I don't really like to mess around with the spirit world, so I'm gonna be very serious and respectful and um, you can see what happens. All right, my idea for dinner was mixed vegetables, lentils, Thai chili sauce, and then I met Robert. What hey, do you recommend? I recommend some carne asada. All right, let's get the carne asada. And how do we, what do we eat with this? Uh, we get we get some bread. All right, but you know what? You're gonna make my dinner tonight. All right. Robert from Cali. Outsource it to the brown guy. Exactly. We're gonna film a great white brown hope right now. You sure you don't want these tortillas? For carne asada, right? You know. As a brown guy, I really don't like tortillas. Unless- That's so strange, I love- uh, Unless they're flour, and even then, I really don't like flour tortillas that Tortillas much. are awesome, dude. You can use them for like everything. I lost my voice if you can't hear me, by the way. Yeah. I'm not trying to be alpha. <laughs> hey, uh, hey, uh, hello. That actually looks really good, though. It's already seasoned and stuff. Yeah, dude. It's Mexican style. Oh, wow. hell yeah, I love Mexican style. You know what they call me? Yeah. Torta. They call you torta. I mean, that means fat guy. <laughs> fat, ugly guy. It, it's uh, unisex, actually. It's gender neutral, so you can call anyone torta. Torta? Yeah, as an offensive term. Look at that I love pepper jack. Would be good. Oh, pepper jack's good. Too. Pepper jack's my favorite. Hell yeah. Pepper jack. It's pepper jack. You want mayo or butter? Mayo or butter? Yeah. Really? In a sandwich, yeah. Oh, it's gonna be like a like a sandwich? Yeah. Okay, just go ahead. I choose butter. Let's do it. All right. Little um, scoop of butter. Never hurt anybody. It's over here. So. All right. Yeah, that That's good. The garlic and herb cool. butter. Yeah. Three bucks. Irish butter. Which is actually. Oh yeah. All right, never mind. Oh, what? Sorry. It's actually pretty bad for you, but it's, it's fine. fine. Everything it's Irish fine. is bad for you. Uh, Ian loves oh. it. Ireland's built on bad ideas, bad things. And he's like, I hit 17,000 subscribers, so we're gonna light off 17,000 fireworks. Right here, <laughs> 17, bro. 17,000 fireworks. Yeah, this is the 17,000 celebration, man. I just wanna say thanks everybody for subscribing and watching the content recently. It's been really amazing. Like my channel has not grown like this, maybe ever. So I'm, I've been really excited. So today we're gonna light off some fireworks and celebrate. And then I'm gonna spend the night in a cemetery. Alrighty, I just wanted to say thank you everybody for 17k. It's not a big milestone, but no, it's, probably it's huge. the only milestone I'm gonna hit for a very long time. So I just, it's not like 100k or like 50k or anything, but 17,000 to me is pretty awesome, dude. So I doubt we'll be celebrating 18k probably next June. Oh, wow. Ian. Wah. Ian. Oh. This is a huge achievement. Stop so, saying, yeah. oh, no, no, yeah. Well, no, because I see YouTubers and they're like, yeah, 100K, 50K, you know, even 20K. I'm like, yeah, 17. Well, fucking but be to humble. Me, it's cool. I am. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. It's awesome. You don't have to be, oh, I'm a little guy. No, be excited that you got 17K. I That's a excited. lot. Did you see me jump up That's and do this fireworks, bro? I'm happy as hell. I just okay, don't want to go, go to jail. Go light them. All right, guys, enough. Here, You're bro. the one who go wants to them. do it. I'm not going to light them. Why not? You're the one that wants to do it. What is this? I recommend watching Japanese horror videos I, if you want to be really... Oh no. Oh no. Oh god. Why is this... 17K! This is not good. We got this. Bro, we got the 17,000 guys. 17k we did it 1738 congratulations to everybody 
We made it. Wait, the big firework didn't light. <laughs> Good. Stop yelling firework. Did it look cool? Yeah, it gave everyone seizures. Well, there's the cemetery I was gonna stealth camp at. But unfortunately, I don't believe it's gonna happen. Robert's here with me and we had the night from hell. A homeless guy, we were streaming and I celebrated my 17,000 subs. I'll throw a clip of that in here right now of us shooting off the fireworks. But um, long story short, we were attacked by a homeless guy. Um, he threatened us with a shank, which I didn't see at the time. Robert saw it. Hey, Robert. We were filming. Unfortunately, we, we're not sure if the live stream was uploaded. YouTube was having a lot of glitches. 45 minute live stream turned into only 15 minutes being uploaded. I We don't know what's I going on. I have no on. idea why the chat was really weird. Like the chat was overlaying it was glitching. all on itself. Which and is a bummer because we had probably one of our... I don't want to say best moments because it was a terrible moment, but one of the best content moments. Yeah, so we were about to fly a drone and it wasn't working. The drone wasn't working. Some guy came up. He, he was he had a really super weird vibe and he looked like Ozzy Osbourne meets Rosie O'Donnell. Mm -hmm. and yeah, that was the first time. The first weird guy. We should have known then because he got out and he was walking real slow. He was and staring he was like at he us. Kept staring at us, and then he went and he was taking pictures because there's a big Marilyn Monroe statue, and he was like taking pictures of her feet, just of her feet. And then he got away, and he was taking pictures of Marilyn Monroe. Keep in mind, this is like what, like twelve midnight. Yeah. So it's very strange to go out and shoot photos like the way he was doing it. He was like smiling at Marilyn Monroe's feet. Yeah. And so then I'm like, all right, dude, let, let's get out of here and let's go by the museum, which is his a great further. idea was go down where there's less light. And it's a little darker because I was like, hey, maybe we could fly the drone because I'm hyped about the drone, man. I've always wanted to see a drone. Um, and anyway, we're like, all right, forget it. Let's leave. We we're going up to the hotel room because we saw there was content going on. Yeah, we were going to go up to the hotel. And all of a sudden, we're, we're on the ground. We're like kind of just sitting down and um, we're packing up our bags, doing our stuff. And then I just hear like the F slur, right? Right. It was just this guy like in the and middle. And I'm like, wait, what? He was in the dark. Like we couldn't see Yeah, he was guy. just completely in the dark. And so Robert's like, he's looking at me like, let's go. And so we just leave. We start walking away. And then that's when I hear him kind of like start yelling, right? He's like, pussies. Mm -hmm. And I forgot what else he said. He was just like, yeah, I'm, I'm going to come. I don't know what he said. He was just he was mumbling. mumbling. Yeah, exactly. He was just he was mumbling, mumbling at this point. He wasn't making any sense. And then he was, he was saying, oh, you want to fight? You want to get cut up? Like, you want to get, like, he said something like, come here. And he, he like, and he popped out like a knife, a, a big knife. It wasn't a machete or, or anything like that, but it was like a big knife that he pulled out and he was coming at us. He got really close. I yeah. got really like, like scared first. Like I thought we were going to die, dude, like get stabbed or something. I was just like, oh, great. Because keep in mind, we were right next to the police department down mm -hmm. there. And I, I told him, I was like, the cops are literally right there. Are we going to mm -hmm. have to call them right now? We're, we're just going to yell at cops right now? And yeah. he's like, why are you that scared? Fucking fight me. I was like, I had pepper spray on me. So I was like, I was ready to go. But we just ran after that. And then we tried to wave down a security guard. He ignored us completely. I thought he was like turning around, dude. But he just left. He just took off. I, he saw me waving him down, like just right in front of him. <laughs> he just and left. he, yeah, he just left. He ignored us. Like I, I talked to him uh, because he was getting closer and. I, Ian was just saying, like, this guy's crazy. This guy's crazy to the live stream. And, and the homeless guy obviously didn't like that. And I was just like, dude, why are you following us? Like, leave us fucking alone. And he's like, you're making fun of me. You're just, like, trying to... What did he say? He was like... He was nuts, dude. He was on drugs. He was mental or something. You're making fun of me. You're talking sense. about me. And we were like... And I was like, dude, we didn't even know anyone was here. We're not talking about you. We're not... Like, we didn't know... We didn't know where you came from. What are you talking about? And he was like, leave, get out of here. And then at the, some point, like, he tried to come after us, and we just ran. Yeah, we just took off. We we and were trying to, like, make some way, make some room, and so we ran to our cars. And so that's why I'm not stealth camping tonight. I really don't feel like sleeping here at a cemetery. Because it's pretty close to where it happened. So. I thought we were going to have good luck. Going to the casino, 
Because I was just like, oh, this is terrible. Like, we almost got stabbed. The, but keep in mind, guys, I want to let you guys know, if you don't see the live stream, this guy was, he can, he can run, he can walk, but he had a chair. Yeah. He had, like, an office chair that he was wheeling around in, and he knew how to maneuver. He was going, like, 10 miles an hour. He caught up like, to us quick. He, like, 10, 20 miles an hour. He was... I don't know how he got that much speed on that thing. He got up to us fast, man, because we were way over, like, to where that tree is, way over there, and he caught up to us quick. Like... Ian and I were just talking to each other and this guy like mumbling and just shows up right in front of us. Yep. So I'm glad that you're not self camping tonight. Yeah, no, forget it, dude. I had bad vibes. And we went to the casino and dude, I'm not even joking right now. Oh my God, this is not. I'm not even joking right now. It's like something, it's just something, I don't know. Let me know, let me know what you guys think. He's, we're, Ian's pulling out money from the ATM at this point. Two quarters come fly. I see them literally like come into the world, like show up. Like, I don't even know from the, from the seal. It looked like they just came out of thin air and they fell as if like, and I just looked around. And I was like, who the fuck is throwing quarters at us? And the worker, the casino worker passes by looking at me like... Like he's on drugs? Like yeah, like, oh, this guy's this guy's nuts. This yeah, guy's on drugs. Crazy. And I don't know, we just got like... We didn't get hit, but they were close enough. They almost did. Yeah, it, it felt like someone tried to out of the throw sky. Them. It was very strange, man. I don't even know. I don't know, dude. And, and that's another reason I just don't feel like... Everyone was out. staring at us at the casino. I'm bummed out, man. Everyone gives us the dirtiest looks. I know. It's very strange, man. We just keep getting looked at. We got almost assaulted, almost killed. This guy could have killed us easy. He thought that we were like, he thought that we were, he was, he was throwing the F slur and he thought that we were making fun of him too. So there, he's like, oh. And he kept repeating that we were gay. Yeah. Like that was a big thing. Like he said that word like three or four times and it's weird, man. I don't know. Like we, I didn't know we was there. He was, yeah, he was just in the middle of the dark by himself. And, and then just... when, when we were at the police station, Robert heard him. Oh, I yeah, got I heard so him. creeped out, dude. I, like, jumped in my car like a 10-year-old, like, running. No, I told him to get I in the car. I jumped in my car, like, locked the door. Lock the yeah, door. after I said, go right now, he was like, oh. Yeah, I was just like, lock, lock, lock. God, I was freaking terrified, dude. I'm so, glad we're all right now. Me too, man. I'm, I'm, I'm really bummed out that we lost 40 bucks together. Yeah, but at least we're alive, dude. We could have lost a lot more than that tonight. We By can, the way, uh, subscribe to Robert from Cali. <laughs> Robert from Cali. Robert from Cali. Yeah. Crazy Cali. I bought all this food, dude. You can cook it. I know. I'm going to eat it, yeah, but... Oh, okay. I got the fog machine. That's true. It just wasn't meant to be, man. No. All right, let's go home. All right. Peace. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Peace, guys. Thanks for watching. And bug grease. And bug Happy 17K, Ian. Thank you. Woo!